hi guys welcome back to urban tech er today's video is about the ram types that run today's computers nearly every computing cable device needs ram take a look at favorite devices example smartphone tablets desktops laptops graphing calculators hdtvs handle gaming systems etc and you should find some information about the ram all through all RAMs basically serves the same purpose. There are few different types of commonly in use today. Static RAM, SRAM, Dynamic RAM, DRAM, Synchronized Dynamic RAM, SDRAM, Single Data Rate Synchronized Dynamic RAM, SDR, SDRAM, Double Data Rate Synchronized Data RAM, DDR, SDRM. DDR2, DDR3, and DDR4 graphics double data rate, synchronized data, dynamic RAM, GDR, SDRM, GDDR2, GDDR3, GDDR4, GDDR5. Flash memory. What is RAM? RAM stands for Random Access Memory, and it gives computers the virtual space needed to manage the information and solve problems in the moment. You can think that like reusable scratch paper that you would write notes, number or drawings on with a pencil. If if you run out the room on the paper, you make more by erasing what is your longer need. The RAM behaves similarly when it needs more space, deal with temporary information running software programs larger pieces of paper allows to scrabble out more and bigger ideas at the time before having to arise more ram inside of computers shares a similar effect ram comes in a variety of shapes the way physical contacts or interfaces with computing systems capacities measured in mb or gb speeds measured in mhz or GHZ guides, architecture, these and other aspects are other more Im important to consider when upgrading systems with RAM as computer systems, hardware, motherboard, have and adhere to strict compatibility guidelines. For example, older generation computers are unlikely accommodate the more recent types of RAM technology laptop memory won't fit in desktops and vice versa ram is not always backward compatible a system generally can't fix the match different types of generations of ram together static ram sram type in market 1990 to present popular products using sram digital cameras shooters printers lcd screens one of the two basic memory types that other being DRAM, SRAM, requires a constant power flow and in order to function because the continuous power as RAM doesn't need a refresh to remember that data being stored. This is why the SRAM is called static RAM. No change or action or refreshing in needed to keep data. Intact. However, SRAM, SRAM is volta volatile memory, which means that all the data had been stored becomes lost once power is cut off. And the advantages of using SRAM versus DRAM are low power consumption and faster access speed. The disadvantages of SRAM versus DRAM cost manufacturing because of these characteristics, SRAM is typically used in CPU cache, example L1, L2, L3 hardware drives, buffer cache, digital to unlock computer converters on video cards. Dynamic RAM Time in market 1970s to mid 1990s, popular product using DRAM, consoles, networking, hardware, and Synchronous Dynamic RAM SDRAM 
time in market 1993 to present popular products using computer memory video gaming consoles and the single data rate synchronized dynamic SRAM SDR SDRAM RAM time in market 1993 to present popular products using SDR SDR RAM SD RAM computer memory video game consoles and the last double rate data synchronized dynamic RAM DDR SD RAM time in market 2002 present popular products using DDR SDRM computer's memory and the last graphic double data rate synchronized dynamic RAM GDDR SD RAM time in market 2003 to present popular products using GDDR SD RAM video graphics cards some tablets thank you Please like, share and comment below and subscribe to my channel Urban Tech ER.